It's okay. Just try to no. try to stay calm. You don't understand, Jason. I don't know what's wrong with you. I'm such a bad person. No, you're not. You're just, you're just going through a tough time right now. Okay. You got a lot of timing. You are quite the rebound, girl. Aren't you, Elizabeth? But this is fast, even for you. I mean, throw yourself into Jason's arms after only two weeks of mourning the wreck you made out of our lives. So much for the terrible danger he presents for the boys. I, I guess their safety just gets thrown by the wayside in the face of your incessant need to play the victim one more Lucky, time. That's, an, that's enough. That's uncalled for. Is it? Let me guess. She came running to you, crying all, woe is me, right? How can any man resist? I mean, you've been there. You know how convincing Elizabeth can be. She'll stick around for a while. It's long enough to blow your whole life to hell, and then she'll turn on the water okay, works stop. and run Let's off stop. to the guy. Okay, stop. That's the, it's okay. I knew I hurt you. But until this moment, I didn't realize how much. I've seen you angry and I've seen you devastated, but I have never known you to be so cruel. Thank you for trying to help. You know what Elizabeth said is right. What you just did is in you. And the lucky I know is disappearing right in front of me. Respect. The guy who just yelled at Elizabeth and humiliated her that way, that's that's not you, Lucky. I don't see anyone else here. Look. Don't you think it's it's a little ironic? You lecturing me when you kill people for a living? Have secret affairs with another man's wife that's and exactly lie about why I can speak to it, because I have to take responsibility for my job, because I chose it. But the other things you just mentioned, that, that wasn't me. Any more than what I just saw you do, that's not you. Every day that I lied about Jake was another day that I compromised myself. Piece by piece. Don't compromise yourself. You're better than that. You know what I was just thinking about? The way you were, right after your accident. You're just a blank slate. No memory, nothing. No context for emotion. You should have stayed like that, Jason. Instead of opening yourself up, letting people in, with their declarations of faith and love, making you vulnerable. I would take an accident like yours in a second, just for the chance to not feel anything anymore. He said it's great. She did? See, I told you we have a budding artist on our hands. There, baby. Are you stuck? Maybe it's, it's Daddy. Look. Look. Hello there. Camden, isn't it? Come here. Come with Mommy, please. What are you doing here? Oh. <laughs> Such a weary look when I am here to say thank you. You've got five seconds to get out of my house before I call the police. Oh, really, Elizabeth? There's no need for histrionics. As I said, I have come to say thank you. And I brought a small token of my appreciation. Elizabeth. 
Because of you, Nicholas has come into his own as a true Cassidine. And in a matter of months, you managed to, to achieve a goal that has eluded me since my grandson was born. I'm eternally grateful. Get out. Get out. Just get out of my house. What did you do to her? Get this woman out of my house. You need to leave. Well, as another token of my gratitude, the Cassidines have controlling interests in several pharmaceutical companies, and if you decide to go the antidepressant route, I will make sure that you get a lifetime discount. Good luck, my dear. Full disclosure, I'm not stalking you. I legitimately came in for a drink. Okay. But I made a deal with myself that if I saw you, I would tell you. Tell me what? I had two very unsettling encounters with Elizabeth today. I'm, thinking, I'm not afraid she's on the verge of a nip shit. Let me uh, stop you right there, okay? Contrary to my recent behavior, I don't wish anything bad on Elizabeth, but she made her choices and if living with them is painful, join the club. You know what I mean? But don't ask me to give a damn about Elizabeth's suffering. Because I don't.